Hi everybody, welcome to our Great British Finned Friends sighting video for June. The dry, warm and sunny weather of late May continued into June, but cooler, wetter conditions spread from the north until the middle of the month, when there was a short, calm, sunny spell. The second half of June remained warm but showery, with thunderstorms and a brief, fine spell in the third week. But the month ended with unsettled, wet and windy weather, particularly in the northwest, from North Wales to the Western Isles of Scotland. The far north of Scotland, on the other hand, had plenty of fine weather and good spotting conditions. Despite much of the month being relatively unsettled, there were lots of sightings of cetaceans around the coasts of the British Isles, particularly in the southwest and northeast. Harper porpoises, as always, were the most widespread species, recorded all around Britain, but particularly in the east of England, from Northumberland south to Kent. Numbers were generally small, most sightings being of one or two individuals, reflecting the fact that this is the peak month for mothers to have their single calves. Bottlenose dolphins were the next most widely distributed species in coastal waters. Besides the ever presence of animals in the Moray Firth, northeast Scotland, groups continued to be seen down the east coast from the Firth of Tay, south as far as Norfolk. There were regular reports throughout the month at locations such as Blythe, Whitley Bay, Tynemouth and Whitburn on the coast of Northumberland, Tyne and Weir and Durham. The small groups of bottlenose dolphins that currently inhabit the southwest of England, particularly Cornwall, were seen further east at Overcombe and Portland in Dorset. In Cardigan Bay, bottlenose dolphins were present at their usual haunts, from Newquay in Ceredigion to Abersoch in Gwynedd. However, the species was also observed regularly around the Isle of Man, as well as off the north coast of Anglesey and in northeast Wales. And in southwest Scotland, there were sightings of small numbers from Ayrshire to the Inner Hebrides, as well as the group that inhabits the waters around Barra and Vartisay in the Outer Hebrides. The large population resident around the Channel Islands was sighted many times in Jersey, Guernsey and Sark. In earlier months this year, there were rather few reports of common dolphins. June, however, saw several sightings of groups up to 40 to 50, mainly off the coast of Devon and Cornwall. Off the Somerset and South Welsh coasts, around the Isle of Man and in the Hebrides. There was also an unusual sighting of a small group in the North Sea, off the Fife coast. Risso's dolphin were seen at a number of their regular haunts off Gwenap Head in Cornwall, North Anglesey, the Isle of Man, Isle of Lewis in the Outer Hebrides, and Orkney and the Pentland Firth. Most groups were less than 10 individuals. Groups of up to 40 white-beaked dolphins were reported from the east coast of the Isle of Lewis, with smaller groups of Strathy Point and the North Sea off the Northumbrian coast. Atlantic white-sided dolphins are a northern species and rarely sighted in the British Isles, south of southern Scotland. They are most frequently seen around the Shetland Isles, but even so, the sighting of an estimated 500 white-sided dolphins west of Shetland was a red-letter day. The Northern Isles are a good area to visit for killer whales, particularly in June, and this year was no exception, with small groups from the northern community identified several times from Shetland, Orkney and the Caithness coast. The species was also seen further south in the North Sea, off the coasts of Moray and Aberdeenshire, with a pod of 12 spotted at Porth Leven. In the Hebrides, up to four killer whales were also seen at various localities, Interestingly, some of those identified were not part of the West Coast pod that traditionally ranges up and down this coast. Three baleen whale species were reported in June. Minky whales were seen at a number of locations, from Cornwall to the Isle of Man, Inner and Outer Hebrides, Northern Isles, Caithness and the Moray Firth. The species was also seen at Whitley Bay and Tynham Weir. Unusually, a minky whale was identified in the southern North Sea, off the coast of Norfolk at Sheringham. 
there was also an unusually large feeding aggregation of up to 20 minkies off Dern Ness. A young fin whale came into the Dee estuary on the borders of North Wales and England. Sadly, it live stranded and died. And one or more humpbacks were seen on a number of occasions at various localities around Shetland, including Athfo, Bresse and Mauser Sound. The increase in number of sightings reported that we have seen month on month continued into June, with at least 625 of 10 species. Not bad considering the COVID-19 restrictions in many areas. Please share our sightings videos as much as possible to receive them automatically into your inbox if you visit www.adoptadolphin.org.uk and then click on sightings videos.